Hey friends, I'm back again with another tip on how to breathe life in to your rounds, on how to shake them up, make them more enjoyable and fun. So today I'm going to embarrass myself a little bit and um, show you something that I have done for quite a while uh, with my rounds to make them really fun. Now this technique or I guess this fun little method um, will not only shake up your rounds, but it will 100% make you laugh, make others laugh, and um, give you a really good dose of the feel-good uh, chemicals, which we all need more of. So I have a fascination with accents and I love listening to people talk from all over the world. Um, you know, that beautiful British accent, um, Irish, Scottish, um, exotic Spanish, or wherever you're from. Um, I love hearing people speak in different voices. So what I started to do <laughs> was do my brain retraining rounds. And again, this doesn't have to be um, just with brain retraining rounds. You can do this as part of your day just to add fun to your day and make it more enjoyable and whimsical and fun. So um, pick an accent, whichever one you like or enjoy, and start to speak to yourself in that accent. So um, if you're doing a specific round or brain retraining program like DNRS or Vitalside or Gupta or whatever you're doing, um, adding in an accent to your proclamations or to the first part of it or doing your whole round in an accent makes it fun. And I'll give you a little example of what I do. Um, so sometimes I like to talk in a Scottish accent and I like to do my visualization with uh, some change. I imagine myself on this gorgeous beach and it stretches out for miles and the sky is so blue and there are these gorgeous birds just flying around and I can feel the wind on my face and it's blowing my hair. And I feel so safe and relaxed here. I So there's one uh, rendition. Sometimes I will go into, um, you know, more exotic accent, um, maybe European or Greek, and um, just speak. Um, I remember when I was a young girl and we had the most amazing trip to Greece and the sun was shining, the beaches were lovely and you get the point. Um, and when I really want to accentuate something and bring attention to it, I will put on that British accent. Um, it's funny because I remember when I used to have um, one of those uh, map quests, whatever they're called, the, the I'm, I'm forgetting what it's called, but the, the thing that guides you where to go before Google Maps in my car, um, I would always put it on the British voice because I feel like I listen more when someone's speaking in British. I don't know if you agree, but um, yeah, just adding in that accent, say, hey, Limby, you're going to be okay. You don't need to overreact, okay? We're safe, relax, okay? Really, I mean, come on. So anyhow, um, totally embarrassed myself probably today, but I don't care because it's all in the name of retraining. And I hope you enjoyed this. I hope this gave you a little bit of, I don't know, um, inspiration to change up your rounds and made you laugh. I hope you laughed more with me than at me. Um, but in the end, I don't care because this made me feel good and you shouldn't care either. Um, anyhow, let me know if this helped and you know try it out let me know how it feels what's your favorite accent to do it to do around in 
Take care and I'll be joining you again soon with another tip.